Gone Dark is a short film which tells the tormented journey of Gina, a young Spanish woman who left her family for London after what appears to be years of struggle and rejection when she started a loving relationship with a mysterious older man. But the memories we are confronted with only show Gina's interpretation of what may turn out to be a much more sinister past than she is willing to accept. From a visual standpoint, our director, Charlie Joslin, has opted for a cross of Requiem for a Dream's macro shots. The merging of past and present scenes as inspired by Eternal Sunshine of the Spotless Mind and the elusive mood of David Lynch's Mulholland Drive. Did you just hear the word ambitious between the lines? Yeah, that's us. Like the title indicates, our story gets indeed quite dark. And that's because we're on a bit of a mission with this film. And the key message is definitely worth spreading. Sometimes you have to break away from things and even people you love to escape a toxic environment. This key theme and message of the film is drawn from multiple stories of abusive relationships that we can all identify with and which you've probably all experienced before, to a minor extent, hopefully. I definitely have. We intend to screen the finished film in middle schools around London and hopefully much farther out than that. In this day of instant text messages and snaps, we believe that too little is being done to inform teenage girls and boys about the dangers of encountering manipulative people as they surely will one day in their life. And we'd like to play a small part in that warning. To achieve all of the above, both stylistically and promotionally, we do need your support. But here, is what we'll do differently than any other campaign. Along with Charlie and Alex, our producer, the three of us have decided to go out there in the streets and introduce ourselves physically to other passerbys and promote our Kickstarter campaign. Armed with a smartphone to show this video and a printed Kickstarter sign, all three of us will spend the next four weekends until the end of this campaign out in the streets of London to engage with real people, gather email addresses, and if lucky, get a few more backers to help with our budget of three and a half thousand pounds. But at least we'll do our very best to increase awareness of Gina's story and her message. So please, like our Facebook page, spread the word, and if you can do anything to contribute to support this project, we will be... You have saved our lives. We are eternally grateful. No, but seriously, thank you for listening.